Good evening, I'm Jack Cottle. Ellsworth Air Force Base is getting an upgrade. Senator Mike Rounds met with the Air Force's Assistant Secretary for Energy, Installations and Environment today to discuss any obstacles remaining before new stealth bombers are brought to the base. Sir Cody Dennis has more. A major focus of Wednesday's meeting was on infrastructure to support the crews who will be moving into the area for the new B-21. Uh, we, we identified a few areas that we can work on uh, with Senator Rounds and his staff, and, and that's what this is all about, uh, partnering, um, uh, cutting through some of the layers that uh, sometimes occur uh, um, from, uh, from planning to execution and then working them out. Although the discussion was about the base itself, Rounds and Chaudhry addressed issues beyond the gates of Ellsworth. There was a disagreement between Douglas High School and Ellsworth Air Force Base about the funding needed to support the new students enrolling. Chaudhry says discussing the area as a whole is why it's important for Rounds and He to meet, and that adding a bomber to the base is truly a team effort. Rounds also emphasized the importance of having these meetings before making any changes. Uh, if you want your airmen to be able to have a place to live, you've got to have housing. If you want your kids to get a good education, you've got to have the schools built when they get here, not after they've arrived. Brown says the exact date that the bomber will touch down on base is classified, but did say that the plan is still on track to have it arrive sometime in 2024.